we're going to be looking at what's new in CarPlay with iOS 9.3 preview, specifically music and maps. So in Apple Music now, for the first time on CarPlay, you can view For You and New, which are major features of the Apple Music streaming service. So this lets you view albums and playlists recommended by Apple Music right on CarPlay. You can also go to the New section, which shows you different curated sections that everyone can see. So the New Music section, for example, lets you see albums that are new to Apple Music. The top song section lets you see the top 20 songs on Apple Music or iTunes. And from CarPlay, you can just start playing them in your car. The album section is the same thing. Top 20 albums, and you can play them right there. I noticed in CarPlay you can't add these to your music collection, though, but I believe you can find these again in your history. There's also an Apple Editor's Playlist section, which lets you browse by genre, and then you can view specific playlists that fit into those categories. These are playlists that Apple creates, and you can just kind of find the ones that you like. There's also a curated playlist section, which lets you find playlists from Apple Music Partners, like the Grammys, where you can view Grammy nominee playlists based on genre. Again, these are all optimized for CarPlay, so they're easy to find without being distracted. Finally, there's a recent releases section, which shows you new music to Apple Music, including recently released albums that Apple Music just picked up. It's the same experience that you'll have on the iPhone, just made for CarPlay. And under the radio section, you'll find Beats 1, the streaming radio station. You can also dig through various genres to find iTunes radio stations, just like you could before. On the playlist section, you'll find both Apple Music playlists that you add to your Apple Music collection, as well as playlists that you create yourself. And the big deal here is that you get a recently added section at the top, so you can find music that you've added recently, not just browse through your massive library of playlists that you've added over the years. The same thing shows up in the My Music section now, which is really helpful, just like on the Apple Music app on the iPhone and iPad. You can still look for your music based on uh, artist or album or song. You can do that alphabetically or you can look through it manually. But the big thing with the CarPlay update in iOS 9.3 preview is that you have the For You and New sections available for the first time. Over on the Apple Maps side, there's a new feature called Nearby, which lets you see destinations based on what's close to you and in what category. So there's gas stations, there's restaurants, there's coffee shops, there's fast food, for example. And you can see the name of the business. You can see the ratings based on Yelp reviews. You can even see what kind of business it is, like coffee and tea, pizza, fast food. You can even see the price points for which ones are more expensive than others, so you can make the decision as you're navigating. And just tapping one of these locations is going to get, instantly give you directions from CarPlay using Apple Maps and on-screen navigation. Previously, this screen was just based on your recent trips. You can still see your recent trips uh, on CarPlay. You can still search for locations as well. But this is really handy in iOS 9.3 Preview. So iOS 9.3 Preview is out for developers today and should be available to the public later this year. Music